Kerala has not yet recovered from the shocking tragedy of uh, Wayanad landslides. But what is now more painful is the way the CPM government of Kerala it has misused and embezzled the funds that was meant for relief and rehabilitation. The reports have very well shown how crores and crores of rupees have been misused by the state government which was meant for the relief of the people of Wayanad. It is unimaginable. 75,000 rupees was spent on the funeral of each uh, who has lost lives in Wayanad. 12 crore rupees was spent on the food for the volunteers. More than 10 crore rupees was spent for travel of the volunteers. So similarly, crores and crores of rupees have been misused by the state government in the name of Wayanad relief. We all remember while it was in 2017 during the Oki cyclone or maybe after later in 2018 during the floods of Kerala, similar things have happened. The state government always uses these disasters as an opportunity for corruption and financial gains. They always, whether it was Oki or the floods or now the Wayanad tragedy, they misuse the funds and have diverted it for purposes for other things. And uh, we all know that the state of Kerala is reeling through a huge financial crisis. Salaries have not been paid. There is a long pending dues of uh, pensions, salaries and other arrears. And the economic crisis is looming large at Kerala. And in such a scenario, such misuse of funds, such embezzlement of funds, it shows how apathetic the state government is to the tragedy of the people. So, Bharti Janda Party, it demands that a proper investigation should happen this time into the ways and means of how the funds of uh, relief that was meant for uh, Wynard was used and a transparent investigation should happen and the people should know how and why this large amount of money was spent in the name of volunteers and other things. Imagine a situation where organizations like Seva Bharati, Hindu spiritual organizations, even the uh, different churches in Kerala, they all have you know, mobilized their resources and people and volunteers and they have done the funerals and other relief work, rehabilitation work without even taking a penny from anyone. And in such a scenario, on the other hand, the Kerala government is spending 75,000 rupees on a funeral. This is an unimaginable situation and investigation has to happen as soon as possible.